I'm Dean Dodge with Strange Engineering. We have for 2015 a new product in our shock market. We have uh, conventional design monotubes, one-way adjustable, two-way, three-way, four-way, and we have returning uh, our monotube through rod. This is a very high-end shock. The rod goes in one end and out the other. Zero rod reaction force, no pressure, no change of uh, preloads on the springs. The line is designed so all the pieces interchange. So if you buy a small adjustment, one adjustment or two, you can upgrade to three or four down the road. We have some other product features that we think are very unique. We have a base valve in here so we can run low gas pressure. Um, on this is a two-way adjustable low speed and you can actually calibrate from outside the shock after you've assembled. Uh, very low friction, a very unique design guide and seal and piston band. Very lightweight, hard anodized. We also have a two-way adjustable with a low speed compression and a high speed rebound for some applications. Uh, the rebound is a little better function on dirt track applications, oval track at the higher speeds. And then we move up to our three-way adjustable. We have, again, some unique features here. We have two adjustments for compression. We actually put our valving directly in the main housing, and it's before the turn. So it's in line, you get better frequency response, lower hysteresis. You're not dependent on 90 degree turns before it reaches the valving mechanism. So the response time is much greater. We can actually tune tire compressibility with this design. And the same thing with the four-way adjustable, where we have a low speed, a high speed, and then again, we have the same valving mechanism. Hi, I'm Jeff Capek with Strange Engineering. I'm sure you guys are new for 2015 billet nine inch case. Uh, this is a 7075 case. Uh, we machined it out of a big chunk of billet and we've included features on it to enhance the stiffness and strength. What we've got here is on the main caps, we've got some extra bolts here and what that does is it increases the stiffness and the strength of the main caps for better gear life. Uh, we've also also increased the flange thickness, the ribs are taller, and the studs are stronger, so, you know, it's, it's a lighter, stronger, stiffer case than an ultra case, and it will take a 10-inch gear, and it fits in a standard 9-inch housing, and this is pinion support to go with it. This is uh, also lighter than an ultra case pinion support, so in total you're going to save about a pound and a half over an ultra case.